habitat destruction is human-induced habitat change that results in a reduction of natural habitat. For every person added to the population, one or two hectares of land was cultivated. Okay. In this process, plants and animals which have previously used these sites are displaced or destroyed. This reduces biodiversity. Because urban development is expected to continue, an estimated 23 million acres of land is expected to be lost by 2050. The extent of forest cover in eastern United States reaches lowest point in 1872. Habitat destruction is the most important cause of species extinction. Because of recent habitat loss, the passenger pigeon and the ivory-billed woodpecker have been recently added to the endangered species list. Causes of habitat destruction or deforestation. Deforestation is the conversion of forested areas to non-forested land for use such as land that can be used for crops, pasture, urban use, or lodged areas, and also wasteland. There are many causes of deforestation. Hi, my name. Get it? In order to build your new building, we're going to have to wipe out all of these trees. Yes, that sounds like a great idea. Deal? Deal. I hate can you stupid little tree. You're ruining my life. Look at how cold it is. And I'm building for you and you don't even thank me. I hate you. I hate you. Trawling is a cause and a method of fishing that involves an activity actively pulling a fishing net through the water behind one or more boats called trawlers. Another cause of deforestation is slash and burn, which consists of cutting and burning forests for agricultural uses. The effects and solutions of habitat destruction. Habitat destruction increases an area's chances to natural disasters such as flood, drought, crop failure, spread of diseases, and water contamination. A healthy ecosystem could help re reduce these chances. Deforestation results in the removal of trees. Birdwatching, hunting, and fishing usually rely on virtually undisturbed habitats. Be sure to defend local habitats and prevent further environmental destruction. Buy a reusable grocery bag to cut down on plastic use. Educate your friends and family about environmental destruction. Clean up your natural habitat. Research endangered wildlife and how you can help to make a difference. The citizens of Oyster Bay voice their opinions. Okay. How should we prevent habitat destruction? Well, uh, to me, I, I would support any conservationist program to this. Probably the, the best way would be to make sure that people who don't have money and can't make a living somehow find a way to make a living. The governments of their countries need to help out and that way they don't have to go in and, and destroy animals and destroy their homes for a profit. Well just some more caring, you know, people not dropping the oil in the sewers and stuff like that. Excellent you know. point, yeah. There's actually nobody seems to really appreciate what we're losing. Mm -hmm. They say that if kids don't bond with nature by the time they're like 10, they never will. So I don't think a lot of people even care about what they're losing. Like I raise my kids at the beach. Well, I, you know, when I go get my lunch, I don't take a paper bag. I try to save a few things, you know. I'm a hunter, so I buy hunting licenses. So I'm helping that way. That money goes through the government in New York, and they help preserve the hunting area.